You know, the 1990s was one of the best eras for guitar. Guitar was a really prominent part of a lot of the songs in the 90s, and as a result, there are lots of memorable strumming patterns that are really great to help us develop our technique on the guitar. Today, we're going to be learning how to play the song Into the Great Wide Open by music legend Tom Petty, released in 1991. Now, we're going to talk a little bit of music theory, what chords are used, as well as how to strum them with on-screen chord and lyric charm. Everybody, welcome. Guitar Guru Jeff here, where my goal is to teach you the guitar lessons I wish I would have had at your playing level and to help you learn guitar funner and faster. Let's grab our guitars and let's dive right in. All right, let's dive right into the verse of this song. So, the verse of this song is going to basically be using two different types of chords for lines one, two, and three. So, for lines one and two, we're just going to use an E minor shape with variations, and then line three, we're gonna be using an A minor shape with variations. So, for the first line of the verse, we're gonna play an E minor, then we're gonna convert this, we know E minor is two and three, then we're gonna convert this by leaving the second finger down, moving the first finger to the first fret of the fourth string into an E minor major seven. Ooh, mysterious sounding chord, isn't it? And then E minor seven's easy, because you just lift the first finger, we only have one finger down, it's just the second finger on the second fret of the fifth string. And then we go to an E minor six. We're gonna just use the third finger. Let's talk about an easy way of playing this one. This is the trickiest part of the song, I feel, this line right here. So what we're gonna do to make this easier, if you need, is to play A minor. Now, for the next chord, A minor with a G, really super easy. We're just gonna use two fingers. The first finger stays where it is. Third finger's gonna go over here on the sixth string, third fret. All right? Sounds pretty close to what the actual chord is. Now the A minor with the F sharp, only two fingers again. The first finger stays where it was on the first fret of the second string. The second finger goes on the sixth string, second fret on the F sharp note. All right, and then we're gonna go back up to the A minor with the G. So this is much easier because we're not using all four fingers now. We're just gonna use two fingers. A minor, A minor with the G is just one and three. A minor with an F sharp is just one and two. Okay, let's go to the last line of the song. We have a G chord. I recommend you play the G chord with fingers three and four. All right, then we go to the F. We're not gonna play a bar chord. We're just gonna play the F chord just like this, three, four, two, and one. And then C. F to C is a pretty easy switch because three and one are already in place, right? Here's the quicker part of the song. When it goes to a G, C, G, G, that's the part of the song, G, C, G, G. All right, moving on to the chorus. Play the G with three and four. Right, line one, G chord, C chord. Play the D. And then G, E minor, and then D, and then A minor, that was line two. Here's line three. G, C, D, and then G, no bar, F, we're gonna play F with three, four, and two, and then E minor, and then here's the cool change, A major, and then of course we have the tag ending, G, C, G, 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 C, G, G. We're gonna talk about the strum pattern. Now the strum pattern for this song is really, really basic. Um, just know that it's down, 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 up, down, 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 up, down, 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 up. Now if that's too tricky because there's a lot going on here with the chords, just keep it straight down strum. It's a really mellow song and it does work just to play a simple down strum. All right, so taking a look at this thing. Eddie waited till he finished high school, right? He went to Hollywood and got a tattoo. Right. Now we can now we can move on to line three now, A minor, right? He met a girl out there with a tattoo too. Last line moves quick. The future was wide open. Okay, here's the quick part. You ready? Down up on G, down up C, G, G. All right, 
let's dive right into the chorus. So just know the strum pattern is gonna be the same as the verse. What is that again? Down, 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 up, down, 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 up. All right, all right, here we go. So same strum pattern, line by line, first line. Into the great wide open. Next line. Here's the tricky part, you ready? Oh, rebel, G chord, rebel without, F chord, up to, G, C, G, 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 C, G, G. And that's it, you did it. Pretty awesome song, isn't it? Please don't forget to like, subscribe, and leave a comment. And remember to stay dedicated, Make it fun and keep practicing. See you in the next lesson.